Hello everyone, this is Ben from Pay Models World Singapore. Now today I want to introduce to everyone the Integral Laser Tech System. As uh, many of y'all would have already known by now, that Pay Models World is actually the appointed distributor for Asia with regards to all Integral accessories and equipment. Okay, so without further ado, I just want to run through with everybody on the set of uh, equipment that we have for Integral. Now this is a Laser Tech System. It is very simple to set up. So for anyone who wants to rent this from us or to purchase a set of the Integral Laser Tech System, just want to let you know that this is so, so easy to get it setting, setting it up. Okay. Now, uh, firstly, of course, let me introduce to you the uh, Laser Tech Markers, as we call it, uh, gun in simple form. Okay. This is a very lightweight equipment that here that I'm holding on to. It is uh, less than 1.5 kilo. Uh, I think it's 1.3 kilo to be exact which means it's very suitable for kids of all ages to play uh, from the age of 5 onwards as old to you know 80 years old if you can still run in the field if you know what I mean this equipment being lightweight it is easy for maneuver it is easy for mobility okay so which means that when you're playing uh, you will not feel a burden as you're holding on to the gun and as you play as you fatigue throughout the game as you get more tired you will still be uh, as aggressive as before and uh, not feel tired because it is simply lightweight. All right, so the Integral gun. And uh, over here, I have a series of guns that has already been set uh, in terms of setting in the way that we want to play. But in a while, I will also show you how we can get this operation set up and how we can get this going in a very fast manner. Okay, and of course, with these uh, guns or markers, I, sh I can say, comes along with the uh, helmet as well. So these are what we call as the uh, helmet sensors. Okay, the sensors are attached on the helmet so that in the event when you're playing as you're shooting and as you're gaming you know all the sensors will detect all the shots and uh, results will be shown at the end of the uh, every game now if i can just do a 360 rotation of the helmet you will notice that there are actually two sensors over here a big one actually there are four sensors in there okay and then two more sensors over here on the left and the right hand side of the helmet so uh for any gamer who wants to play, basically you put this on and then as you run around the field, uh, these sensors will detect the shots and uh, the results of these hits will be then forward and uh, through a Wi-Fi system that will be transmitted uh, to the computer and generate a computation of results at the end of the event. Uh, let me come back to the gun again. The gun comes with a sensor as well. So this part of uh, the gun, the, the front portion, is where the sensor is located. So uh, the other thing that you should take note of is the smart box now this smart box over here is basically the brain uh, of the whole entire system CT can you turn off that uh, ding 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 thank you so much it's very irritating okay let's continue with the video so you are still watching then the smart box is actually the brain of the whole entire laser tech system uh, this smart box basically runs on uh, Wi-Fi so once this is turned on the system runs on itself as long as the uh, the smart box is turned on so here i'm just going to show you a very simple demonstration uh, of course before doing that all this equipment has to be charged and they will be charged through what we know as the marker charging box now one of these charging box allow us to charge up to 10 equipment okay so if you have two and you have 20 pieces of equipment going out at the same time you can actually charge both of them at the same time using just one charger alone okay so this charger gets connected to the plug with uh, the voltage coming through and it disperses all the voltage and current through the rest of the other equipment the sensors as well as the gun so once again at any one time 20 sets of equipment can be charged at the same time okay which means fast charging turn around game will be faster okay uh, all this equipment comes with a remote as well the remote is basically like a remote control you, you just use a remote control for your TV likewise for the gun it requires a remote for us to turn all the guns on so I'm now going to just do a demonstration of me turning on all the guns. Okay, so you can also see from the front, which later on we're going to do that. Okay, so let me turn this on. Okay, you hear that? So it says integral inter entertainment. So it takes about three seconds for the gun to be turned on. All you need to do is to align the controller to the gun and the uh, gun will actually turn on so here I'm going to turn on everything okay
Okay, so now that all the guns are turned on, we have to start the game. Now, in order for us to start the game, okay. remember, early on I mentioned about this brain over here, which is the smart box. Let me turn the smart box on. So by easy you press of a button, the smart box gets turned on. And here, I'm also going to turn on the sensors located on the helmet. Okay, it's turned on already. So the number of flashes means it's the number of uh, power or energy that's still left in the, uh, the batteries. Okay, let me go back to the, the smart box. Okay, the smart box is still loading, so it takes a while for the smart box to load. Once this is loaded, the game can be uh, started. It can be set using a very simple uh, iPad or you can even do it on your mobile phone. So it's uh, iOS or Android compatible. Okay. So let's wait for a while uh, for this uh, small box to, to get it up and running. You can see that it's still loading. So it, it, it takes a, a few moments. Okay, it's set up already. It shows an integral uh, logo here. So what we do with your smartphone or with your iPad, now you need to go to the, uh, the setting for the Wi-Fi. So make sure you can detect the signal that's coming out from the smart box. So what I will do, I will go to setting and then I'll go to Wi-Fi and then under Wi-Fi, I will be able to see a, a protocol name. Okay, click on the protocol name and then of course I have to key in the password. Now, once the password is connected, I have to go to uh, the system program. Okay, and the system program is basically an IP address that you can uh, access using the uh, Safari app. Okay, as you can see, we are already into the app. Okay, so once you are into the app, now I want to turn, I want to do a setting, which means I want to set uh, a, a game so that the game can commence. So what I will do is, I will start a new session. I will give the new session a name. Maybe let's call it uh, test. Okay, and once this is done, I will go click on OK. Okay, now that this has been set, I'm going to do uh, auto marker, which means it is going to set the, uh, sorry, I'm going to do uh, add players to set the number of players that are in the game. Now we have uh, a total of six guns here, so I'm going to do six, six gun setting. Okay, so now we will do the uh, assignment of the teams. So the teams will be assigned according to the icon that you want to uh, assign them to. Basically, if you have two teams, you assign them to two icons. If you have three teams, you assign them to three icons, so they'll be split accordingly. Now, the reason why you need to split them into teams is to prevent friendly fire. And of course, at the same time, you are able to compute the results at the end of the game, right? So, uh, let me do the setting for all the different teams. Okay, now it's done already. Just listen carefully to the start of the game as I press the play button. This basically erases off all the previous setting that has been uh, input into the gun. And a new setting will be input into the system. Can you hear that? Okay, so Okay, so this means that the gun is all set to according to the new system and they are all ready to play. Alright, so the guns are all set already. Now of course at this juncture we would have had these two equipment being set on a different uh, system as well. So just to for demo purposes, the, the camo uh, helmet refers to one team and then of course the black helmet refers to the other. So, this is the number 11 uh, person, which is assigned to number 11 gun. And this is the number 1 player, assigned to, of course, gun number 1. Okay, so this is gun number 1. I'm going to shoot at this guy, shooting at his sensor. Okay, so basically you press the trigger, and then you shoot. Can you hear that? And of course, if I want to reload, I can press this button, which is a reloading button. Okay, and I can continue shooting at him. And this guy will be disabled every time I shoot at him. Okay, and you, you will notice that there is actually a screen over here that indicate the number of lives that you have, which is in this case 15, and of course the number of rounds that's left in the, in the, in the gun. So as I press, you will notice that the number actually changed. Let me press again. Can you see that? To two, and I've last two more shots remaining in the gun. 
And after I fire the last two shots, you realize that there's no more ammo. So it gives out another, a sound to indicate there's no more ammo. Alright, so what I need to do, again, press the reloading button. And this thing is good to go again. Okay, so the game goes on and on, and that's how easy you set up the game. It basically takes us less than, what, 5 minutes? And as soon as the game is done, what I need to do is I stop the game. Okay, and once the game is stopped, I will now download the game. Okay, uh, when you press the download button, you basically get a series of uh, results from the game uh, statistics. You hear the siren going off, this means that the information is being downloaded. Oh, after the information has been downloaded, I can actually view the statistics to see how many shots each of them has taken, how many hits they have taken, how many times they are being limited. And uh, this basically comes up into a screen that can be captured through this system using the uh, smart box of course. And over here, I will be able to show the results that are being uh, captured. Okay, and of course, this is one set of game. And if you can, you continue to play again by doing a reset on the uh, iPad or your mobile phone, and the next game will start and commence. Okay, we have come to the end of the demonstration. And if you are interested to find out a little bit more about the Integral Laser Tech System, please send us an email at singapore at integral.com and we will contact you shortly with more information about how you can purchase this system and also how you can rent this system uh, for yourself, for your event, for your corporate birthday parties, for your family day, for your corporate events, for your bachelor party, and of course for your friends and family. So uh, stay tuned to our next video and we'll see you the next time. Bye-bye.